Welcome back. If you're planning to be outside to watch the fireworks tonight and wondering what you need to bring, CEO and founder of Alpaca Picnic and Events, Sora Miller Carlos, gave us some tips for packing the perfect picnic. So welcome to California Live. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Sora, this setup is so beautiful. Yeah. And it's you're so talented, Aww. but you know what? We all can't do this on our own. So if we want to go the simple route, yeah. what do we need? What do well, we need to do? You can definitely have a great picnic just by bringing things from your house. Um, the first important thing I would say is to bring a large blanket where everybody could fit comfortably on the ground. We have a large blanket here like this, mm -hmm. and uh, definitely water. <laughs> Yes. It can get very hot during the summertime, so you want to make sure everyone's hydrated. You could bring um, water in an insulated bag like this, mm -hmm. where you can keep your beverages. Oh. And I we'll have one right here, actually. Yeah. I'll put it right here. And then you can't forget the food. There are lots of picnic-friendly foods that you can bring. You can bring sandwiches, cut up some fruits, some of your favorite snacks. And if you forget to bring something or there's not enough food, nowadays you can DoorDash or you can have different food service carriers bring the food to you. They'll bring it right to the thing. park? Yeah. yeah, it's a thing. Okay, <laughs> it's a thing. And then I would say to make sure you bring some sunscreen, mm -hmm. um, hand sanitizers, paper towels, and wet wipes if, you know, it gets messy and you want to keep your hands clean. And um, if you really want to elevate your picnic, you can bring a Bluetooth, speaker where you can pair with your phone and play your summer playlist. That is so cute. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. I'm sorry. I have to pick this yeah. up. It's a record player. And it's thin. No, it's so cute. And games are really big in our household. Um, Jenga, Uno cards actually brought these with us. And you could bring them to your picnics and um, have some fun. And no event happens without a picture, right? So you got to oh, bring yeah. the camera, right? It didn't happen if there's yeah, not a picture. No, exactly. <laughs> so and sunscreen? Yes. Umbrella. Oh yes, yeah. yes. If you cannot secure a shaded area, and you have an umbrella home, bring it. And oh, and also, if you prefer not to sit on the ground, you can bring a lounge chair as well. Okay, and so Sora. People can actually experience this on their own, right? Yep, yep. If you if you want a Sora creation here, <laughs> what do you have to do? Well, you can go on our website. We make it very easy. You can pick your packages. We have add-ons. We can customize the theme if there's any special requests. And once we confirm all the details, like the location, date, time, number of guests, we come, we secure a good spot, we <laughs> set everything up, and then you just bring your guests and enjoy your picnic, and then we come back and make sure we clean everything up. And lucky for all of you out there right now watching, because there's a code hidden here. And Sora, what happens if someone finds the code? Yeah, so there's a code here, and the first five people that could find it, they can go on their website, like I mentioned, pick their packages, and um, make their booking request, and then they just input that code, and they can get 10% off for any July and August uh, booking. All right, and you'll come right to them and set something up just like this? Yes. Yes, and we could accommodate up to 20. Oh, wow. Yeah. 20 people for the picnic? Yeah, it's really beautiful. We, we set it all out, and it's, it's actually really beautiful. Well, Sora, thank you so much. Thank I think the message here is your picnic is what you make it.